Welcome to this week in 5 minutes news bulletin on Ghana District TV. It's a special day for all our gallant farmers across the country. We say are you cool? And to you our cherished viewers, expect some top stories that are making headlines in Ghana as well as the blasters of Ghana game today. I am Mawena Wakate. Now the headlines. Our great minister Dr. Ifi Yakuto reaffirms rationale behind the PFJ markets in major cities of the country. Contractors working on the Koforidia Jackson Park redevelopment project have up to December to complete phase one of the facility. Also, more jobs for youth in Afuega as Nodai DCE initiates plans for a new textile factory in the area. Over 200 shops at Cantamanto have been destroyed following Tuesday's inferno. It's revenge against Luis Suarez at the Al Janoub Stadium as Ghana plays Uruguay today. We'll bring you more about the match. Please stay. Don't go away. Ghana's Agric Minister Dr. Uwusu Efri Yakoto says the recent introduction of the planting for food and jobs market in major cities of the country aims at facilitating the cartel of food from producing areas to urban centers, reduce food prices and also lessen the burden of consumers. He was speaking at the opening ceremony of the maiden four-day agriculture fair in Kaforidia. My ministry has parliamented the PFJ market to facilitate the cut of food from the producing areas to urban market centers to reduce food prices in order to lessen the burden of consumers. Meanwhile, all four contractors working on the Kaforidia Jackson Park redevelopment project have up to December this year to complete work on phase one of the facility. Municipal Chief Executive of the area, Isaac Apau Jesse, revealed this in an interview with Ghana Districts TV. The first phase will end uh, in uh, December. Starting January, we'll be hitting the second phase. That is where people will begin to see the real beauty of Jackson Park. And I'm telling you, when we are done with the construction, it will be one of the finest parks we have across the entire country. Over 200 shops at Cantamanto in the central business district of Accra have been destroyed following Tuesday's inferno. Susan Nadansu was at the scene and reported more on the incident. The like 3 o'clock. The Nodai District Assembly will soon enter into an agreement with a private developer which will see to the construction of a new textile factory in the district. District Chief Executive Edmond Kujuata says the move is a giant step to help create more employment opportunities for the youth. There is this proposal uh, on the line. Uh, we want to see if we can replicate what is happening in ATL. We want to have a whole garment factory in North Dine. We want to go into proper PPP. We know how the assembly will benefit because we are going to draw people from the street. Uh, sorry to say, our unfortunate young boys and girls who are into some other immoral activities. And so it is key. It's the Black Stars against Suarez today. Sports is up next. The Black Stars of Ghana just needs a point in their make or break match against Uruguay today and also hope for a positive result in the match between South Korea and Portugal to book a spot in the round 16 stage of the ongoing FIFA World Cup. However, some Ghanaians say they expect nothing but a win over Uruguay. Hey, we wish the Black Stars all the best. And this brings us to the end of this week in 5 Minutes News Bulletin on Ghana District TV. For more information, you can interact with us on our various social media handles at Ghana District or visit ghanadistrict.com. My name is Mawena Wakati. Thanks for watching.